those just joining us again, you're watching and listening to the Worldwide Truth of God radio <laughs> program, a pre-recorded program coming to you from the International and General Assembly of the First Church of Our Lord Jesus Christ of the Apostles' Faith. Our address is 2431 Frankfurt Avenue, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, right here in the United States of America, where Pastor Gino Jennings is our leader, teacher, guide, and general overseer. Wonderful. Now you can write or email us for any of the following, a current listing of all our radio and television stations, a listing of our church locations both within and outside the United States, a listing of biblical literature written by Pastor Jennings, and the church's magazine, The Truth of God Journal. That's The Truth of God Journal, the second edition, which is now available for five U.S. dollars. A cassette recording of this, The Truth of God, radio and television program can also be obtained at the cost of five U.S. dollars. However, when writing in and requesting copies of this broadcast, we do always ask that you indicate the program number clearly, clearly within your correspondence. Now, today's or tonight's program number is 457. Once again, a cassette recording of this, The Truth of God, radio and television program can also be obtained at the cost of five U.S. dollars. However, when writing in and requesting copies of this broadcast, we do always ask that you indicate the program number clearly, clearly within your correspondence. Now, today's or tonight's program number is 457. Again, that number is 457. Now, if you desire to have the gospel preached in your area, in person, by Pastor Jennings, or have questions regarding this program, or simply regarding the scriptures, again, you may address all your correspondence to Pastor Gino Jennings, First Church of Our Lord Jesus Christ of the Apostles' Faith. Again, if you're listening or watching for the first time, our address is 2431, that's 2431 Frankfurt Avenue, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, right here in the United States of America. The postal zip code is 19125. You can also email us, our email address is truthofgodaterals.com. Once again, our email address is truthofgodaterals.com. You can also visit us on the World Wide Web. Our address there is www truthofgod.com. Once again, our website address is www.truthofgod.com. Quickly to our French-speaking listeners, nos saints salutations à tous nos auditeurs francophones au nom de Jésus-Christ. Nous sommes la vérité du Dieu, programme radiophonique avec le pasteur Gino Jennings. Cette émission vous parvient de la première église de notre Seigneur Jésus-Christ de la foi apostolique situé à 24 31 Frankfurt Avenue à Philadelphie, Pennsylvanie, 1925 aux États-Unis d'Amérique. La vraie plan du salut du Dieu demande le repenté et le baptême dans l'eau au nom de Jésus-Christ pour l'absolution de vos péchés et que vous sauviez le cadeau du Saint-Esprit comme il est décrit dans la Bible. Nous vous invitons à notre clé pour recevoir une documentation gratuite en français ou en anglais intitulée « Êtes-vous honné, femme prédicatrice et Jésus-Christ et Dieu Tout-Puissant » Encore une fois, nous vous rappelons notre adresse, première église de notre Seigneur Jésus-Christ, de la foi apostolique, 24 31 Frankfurt Avenue à Philadelphie, Pennsylvanie, 1925 aux États-Unis d'Amérique. Dieu vous bénisse. Nous espérons avoir de vos nouvelles très prochainement. That's to our French-speaking listeners. Now I'm honored to present unto you the servant of God and general overseer, our leader, teacher, and guide, Pastor Gino Jennings. Greetings, brothers and sisters, friends, and to my loyal enemies. This is First Church of Our Lord Jesus Christ of the Apostles' Faith. We're located here at 2431 Frankfurt Avenue in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, and the United States of America, where you're always welcome to come and hear the Bible preached. Amen. Not supposition, not ideas, but what is written in the Bible. Amen. <clears throat> we are thankful for the closing of this. National 10th Men's Conference. Amen. Amen. Thank God for brethren. Amen. 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 It's a wonderful thing that when you have knowledge, when you got proper knowledge, you won't be deceived and be out there following a false prophet. Amen. 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 In which 
all of us sometime in our life were victim of. Amen. 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 Television viewer and listener, our job is plain and simple. And that's to guide you right because you've been misled almost all your life. Amen. 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 This telecast, this radio program, as I said on one occasion, is not another religious scam. No, mm -hmm. no, We're not over the air to play with you with the Bible. No, Amen. 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 We don't have no fake water to give you. If you want water, go in your refrigerator and get it. Amen. 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 We don't have no good luck charms either. Amen. 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 God don't deal with luck. Amen. 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 You're either blessed of him or cursed by him. Amen. That's right. So, you contact your relatives and your family. Amen. Mm -hmm. That's right. Call your children because this is what they need. Yeah. Amen. Let them look at everything else on television that isn't worth nothing. Amen. Amen. Let them look at rap music and basketball and baseball and mm -hmm. some TV evangelists who've been deceiving you for years. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Robbing you out of your social security check and heaven Amen. knows what else. That's right. Amen. Amen. Well, now you get a chance to sit and learn and be made something. Amen. Other than having the devil make you a fool. Amen. Amen. So we thank God for all the brothers that is present. And we dedicate this broadcast to all the men Amen. that are here. All the men listening in to the hundreds of brothers of the first church of our Lord Jesus Christ in prison facilities throughout America. Amen. And out of America, we greet the saints and Africa and Jamaica and uh, Zambia, Zimbabwe, Nigeria, and Ghana, and Kenya, everywhere. Amen. Amen. We're certainly thankful for God making it possible that Elder Johnson and Elder Bryant and the others that came with them from the old country in London, England, God bless them to be here. Amen. Also, Bishop Perry of Kingston, Jamaica. Amen. Now, radio listening, television viewer, if you want to be right, sit tight. That's Amen. right. Wonderful. We got some good stuff to give you. Amen. Amen. Because a man that have good understanding refused to be led anymore by a false prophet. That's Amen. right. Amen. Not only that, a man that have understanding won't let a woman preacher lead him. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> you understand? That's right. Don't let no woman preacher lead him. He won't stoop to such a little thing. Because a woman that's a real woman, if she get married, she want to marry a real man. Yeah. Don't want to marry no hen pecking. Amen. Someone break in the house and he tell her, go see who it is. That's right, man. <laughs> she don't want that. Yeah. Amen. All right, I got some mail to get out the way from some listeners and viewers. And afterwards, I'm going to ruffle your feathers good fashion. Amen. Don't forget, you call your bishop, tell him to tune in too. Amen. I don't care who he is, because uh, he need what I'm telling him. All. That's right. Amen. Some of the preachers, in fact, the preachers is 99% of the problem. Amen. If you can get the pulpit straight, then the people have a chance to be straight. Amen. Amen. But if the pulpit is crooked, he's going to have a crooked teaching. Amen. And crooked teaching develops a crooked people. Amen. That's right. All right, let's go to work. Camden, New Jersey. Yes. Their first church of Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. I was watching Channel 61 on Sunday morning, and I heard this reverend. I don't know his name, but he touched my heart. This gentleman made me look at life differently. It was like God made me turn this channel on. At this gentleman was speaking. Another guy was reading the Bible. I heard him speak about drugs and being trapped in sin. Mm -hmm. Prison of the mind. I was stressed before I heard this gentleman speak because I was just thinking of the same. I accept Jesus as my Lord and Savior. Can you please advise me the days you are on the radio and TV? Please, and the preacher's name, thank you. May God bless you sincerely. This is from Stephen Owens in Camden, New Jersey. Well, God willing, we're seeing the information that you desire. By the way, my name is Jennings. Amen. <laughs> and I'm not a reverend. No, no, no. Not at all, sir. That's right. No, no, no. That's right. Not at all, sir. Uh, I say this not to condemn you. I say this to help you because you didn't know better. Only one can better title reverend and get away with it is God. Yeah. That's right. Bible says, holy and reverence is his name. Amen. Amen. You don't have Reverend Paul. 
You have Apostle Paul. That's right. You don't have Reverend Titus. You have Bishop Titus. That's right. You didn't have Reverend Timothy. You had Evangelist Timothy. That's right. Do you understand? That's right. So uh, you keep tuned and God willing, we'll, we'll, we'll get you on the right track. Amen. All right, next letter. Cape May Courthouse in New Jersey. Mm -hmm. Dear Pastor Jennings, I watch your television program on Channel 61 every Sunday Wonderful. when possible. The sermons always lift up my spirit. I'm asking for your prayers for my family and myself. I have two daughters. Sabrina is attending Temple University, and Lillian is a fourth, year, fourth, fourth, grade, fourth grader. Mm -hmm. Could you please send me any materials that you have that may help me better understand our Lord? Yes. Thank you. God bless. It's from Catherine Devane in Cape May Courthouse, New Jersey. All right, New Jersey. Thank you for that wonderful letter. We'll send you what you desire. All right. Smyrna, Delaware. Mm -hmm. Dear Brother Gino, May the blessings of Allah be with you from, for your intentions. Mm -hmm. My name is Donnie Parker. I am writing and speaking for myself and my Muslim brothers. My Muslim brother and I wrote, woke up early Sunday to ponder and reflect on your program. All right. We are, con we, contend, we are content with the way of our way of life, but we must tilt our hats to you. We must never send, see, we have never seen a brother with your knowledge of the scriptures and, speak, and that speaks with sincerity. They tend to water down things and prepare their speech the night before. Is an attitude. Amen. Mm -hmm. Making it pleasing to their ears. You give it raw with no chaser. We wish you came on more often. So do I. <laughs> All right. I know you don't want us to get a firm understanding. I, I know they don't want us to get a firm understanding because they themselves are confused. Mm -hmm. In religion, we tend to find that man has tampered and altered a pure thing. This is due to lack of understanding. Yes. We know that they have to pay, have to pay for that. Their reward will be hellfire. Mm -hmm. we, can take pretty, we can take pretty, pretty a fair, Farrakhan. His slick suits and pretty hair is going to lead him to hellfire. That's the truth. Amen. He is so caught up with those restaurants. Now remember, this is Amen. a Muslim writing this. Amen. 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 All right. We can take pretty Farrakhan. His slick suits and pretty hair is going to lead him to hellfire. Mm -hmm. He is so caught up with these restaurants and all of the other materialistic things that arouse him. He's forgotten all about Allah. His, in his intelligence is harped by his... His intelligence is, uh, is harp, but he has misled millions of people through, throughout the years. On that great day, quote unquote, all of those people he has misled will have to stand up and bear witness against him. He's so far gone that he's not even teaching Elijah Muhammad's teaching. There's his. I suppose they're still waiting for W.D. Farad to return. He left in the late 1930s and has not been back. You won't see him back either. Amen. 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 Next time you will see Farad Muhammad is then standing before the great God of heaven. That's Amen. right. And the white throne of judgment. Amen. 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 That's the next time you will see him. Then after that, he's judged. Then he'll be dumped in hell. Amen. 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 You won't see him no more then. Amen. All right. Let's move quick. Let them keep waiting while I write. Yeah. His seat is being prepared in hell. My brother, please continue to spit the pure understanding. With the help of God, I do that. We'll continue to listen and seek the knowledge as we are taught, from the cradle to the grave. Take care, and may Allah reward you. Sincerely, this is from Bonnie Parker, Donnie Parker, Booker Martin, in Smyrna, Delaware. All right, that's enough. We'll get the other letters later. All right, we thank God for the letters, and we have plenty as always, but we're knocked off because it's time now. It's time. Amen. You know what time it is, you looking in my old face. That's right. You know what time it is. That's right. Amen. It is time now to get what you should have been getting for years. Amen. Amen. Truth preach. Truth. Amen. You've been going to church. Amen. And that's what most folk have been doing that only. Go mm -hmm. to church. Mm -hmm. Or what is called church. That's right. And uh, you go to church with the cigarettes and gambling and prostitution and do whatever you want to do and just hide under a rock label Christian. Amen. <laughs> you no more like Christ than the devil out of hell. That's right. There's only one thing that make you like Christ, obedience to him. That's it. You don't obey him, you're not like him. That's right. See, a lot of folk don't like to hear it like that because they look for loopholes like purgatory. Amen. There is no purgatory. It's no, no. heaven or hell. That's right. 
And that's the way God have it. That's the way it is. All right, let's go to work in the book of Timothy, if I'm correct. Mm -hmm. We want to endure something. That's right. We want to endure some hardness. Hardness, that's right. Follow me in the Bible, television, view, and radio, listening, you that are here. Amen. Follow me in the Bible because I have one man, he's seen me, he said, you know, I'm late every Sunday morning because of your telecast from going to church. Mm -hmm. I told him, you're better off not even going. That's right. I had someone emailed me and told me, you shouldn't tell folk don't go to church. That's don't right. tell me nothing. Mm -hmm. The Bible says, come out from among them and be separate. That's right. Now listen, if you know that a bank don't pay interest, mm -hmm. will you put your money in that bank? No, no. Here you have a bank that give you 6 or 7 or 8 or 12 percent interest. Amen. And here's a bank don't give you no interest. That's right. What you going to do? Mm -hmm. You going where the interest is. That's right. Now, God's church mm -hmm. give you interest. Amen. Because it put interest on your mind. That's Get right. some knowledge on it. Amen. And this is what is destroying you that are looking at me, you that are listening. No knowledge. No knowledge. Just got somebody occupying a pulpit that have became a place of entertainment. That's or right. Stage. That's right. Nothing but a circus. That's all. And then you go there for years and years and become old and then die. Mm -hmm. Then they give you a home going sense. Amen. Preacher have a lot of good things to say about you then. Oh yeah. You don't want to tell the folk that you drank yourself to death. That's right. You don't want to tell the folk that you died in adultery. That's right. You don't want to tell the folk that you ran and chased women. Amen. You don't want to tell the folk that you was an old gay man. That's right. Go ahead. They just want to toss you up in heaven. That's right. You ain't going nowhere but right here. That's right. And hey. submit yourself to God divine law. That's right. All right, well, let's go to work. Let's rack all the false churches on the table and Amen. put the devil right in the corner pocket. Second all Timothy. Right, let's have it. Second Timothy chapter 2 and at verse 3. Yes. Thou therefore. Listen. Amen. Thou therefore. Endure. Endure. Hardness. Hardness. As a good soldier of Jesus Christ. All right, let's break it down. Break it down. Amen. Amen. Anytime you endure a thing, mm -hmm. yeah. you're going through something. That's right. Yeah. That's right. That's right. And all the time or sometime, mm -hmm. many of the things that you have to endure mm -hmm. are not pleasant. Amen. Right. But because it isn't pleasant, that don't mean it isn't good for you. That's, That's right. right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. Sometime when we endure things, mm -hmm. we think that everything must be pleasant for us. Amen. Endurance bring about development. Amen. Right. Now the Bible says endure hardness, hardness. as a good, good soldier. soldier. Now listen good. Go you ahead. have soldier Amen. and you have good soldier. Good soldier. Amen. 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 A good soldier is one that I hang in there. That's Amen. right. When anyone coming to the military you don't come in a soldier. No, that's, no, right. that's right. You come in to be trained and turned into a soldier. Amen. 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 You come in many times, no discipline. Amen. Amen. That's right. Amen. Used to be a drug dealer. That's Amen. right. Amen. right sir. Gang banger. That's Amen. right. Murderer. Amen. Amen. Rapist. Amen. Amen. Extortioner. That's Amen. right. Used that's to right. get a high all the time. That's Amen. right. That's right. So you see a need of discipline in your life and you go to the military. Yes, That's right. right. They go through different forms of training, sometimes stepping in time. Mm -hmm. Amen. And repeating things at the same time. That's right. Right. That's right. In other words, the objective of the drill sergeant mm -hmm. is to take that man from Kentucky. Right. Take that man from New York. Come on, preacher. Take that man That's from California. That's right. Take yeah. that man from Texas. Come on. Yeah. Take all the men from different backgrounds, That's yeah. right. different ethnic groups, That's yeah. Right. Yeah. and make one man. That's right. That's right. Come on, preacher. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. Our job is to take all oh, yeah. the different men That's right. Right. and create one man. One man. That's right. That's right. Hallelujah. That's right. All right, listen. That's right. right. When you create one man, you got a whole unit. Yeah. With one mind, yeah. one purpose, yeah. pressing towards the same goal. Yeah. 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 
Amen. So God can pair being a good soldier, enduring the hardship of a soldier, because when you come into the military, you got hardship. Amen. Your hardship is the training process That's right. Amen. to become what you claim you want to be. That's Amen. right. That's right. Okay. So sometimes you got to get up at a time you're not used to. Amen. Amen. Right. Military is given to produce discipline. That's Amen. Right. Discipline break unwanted yeah. habits. Yes, sir. Come on. Yes, sir. Go ahead. Yes, sir. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. And go ahead. have a church. Go ahead. Go ahead. Come on. Go ahead. Amen. And God's men supposed to be good soldiers. Good soldiers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. That's right. Well, now God is the yeah, commander yeah. and chief. Yes, yeah, sir. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. That's right. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. That's right. That's right. That's right. Your brother Minister Jennings. All right. Come on. Come on. That's I'm the drill sergeant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. That's right. Go ahead. The right. men you see sitting behind me. That's and many of the men in the congregation you don't see. Some used to be drug dealers. Yeah, that's, right. Right. That's, right. That's, right. that's right. That's right. That's right. Stolen before. That's right. Right. Amen. Time passed, swear. That's right. Amen. That's right. Amen. 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 That's right. You can't act like you always was right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. Come on. Amen. Come on. Come on. Come on. That's right. Come on. 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 Come it's a weak army. That's right. That's right. Amen. You can't be a strong soldier with a gay drill, son. That's right. That's right. Civilian life. Civilian life. Amen. Amen. 
But to be a good soldier, good soldier. Yes, you need a good teaching. That's right. Good teaching make good soldiers That's right. out of men and women. Amen. Discipline. Because we put discipline mm -hmm. in their life and bring their life under subjection That's right. to a power that is higher than themselves. That's right. In Job chapter 36. Listen at the scriptures. And at verse 10. All right. He openeth also their ear. He openeth also their ear. To discipline. To discipline. And commandeth. And commandeth. That they return from iniquity. You see this? Amen. The Bible says, endure hardness as a good soldier of Jesus Christ. No man. No man. That warreth. That involved. Entangleth himself. Himself. With the affairs of this life. With the affairs of this life. That he may please him. That he may please him. Who hath chosen him. Who hath chosen him. To be a soldier. Amen. <laughs> oh yeah. The Lord our God chosen his people. That's right. To be a soldier. Soldiers. Amen. We pledge our allegiance mm -hmm. to God. That's right. We do not pledge our allegiance to America. That's right. That's right. For we already been drafted. That's right. Oh yeah. For he said when you hear my voice. Amen. Pardon not your, not heart. your heart. That's right. Now, when you say good soldier, good soldier. you don't take shortcuts mm -hmm. for promotion. Amen. That's right. That's right. You understand? Amen. Say, when you're not a good soldier, mm -hmm. you're scared That's right. of endurance, endurance. And you're a cheat to get promoted. That's right. Try to get on the good side of your commander. Amen. To get promoted. That's right. But when you say good soldier, good soldier, no shortcuts. Oh no. No, no. You go through the hardship. That's right. You go through the physical abuse. That's right. Because anytime you serve God, there's physical oh, yes. abuse. Amen. That you will encounter. That's right. Oh yes. Oh yes. Anytime God says abstain from fornication. Amen. And a man and a woman is used to fornicate. That's right. At will. Amen. But they want discipline mm -hmm. and decide not to fornicate no more. No more. That's abuse. That's abuse. That's right. That's right. <laughs> yes, it is. Yes, it is. Amen. That's nothing but abuse. Amen. Amen. Hardship, Hardship develop a man. Oh, yeah. Hardship develops a woman. That's right. You cannot serve God with this easy, cheap religion no, no. that you folks been exposed to. Amen. Amen. See, you can go to an army surplus store. Mm. And come out a general. That's right. That's right. That's right. Am I right? Amen. You can go to an army surplus store mm -hmm. and your shirt is army, your pants is navy. That's true. That's right. In fact, you can go to an army surplus store mm -hmm. and come out having any rank you want. Amen. Pentagon don't know you. No, no. President never seen you. That's right. You never fought for nobody and nothing. Amen. That's what have happened, brothers and sisters. Mm -hmm. Some fella mm -hmm. went to some Bible college. That's right. Come on, preacher. That's right. Some seminary school. Amen. And went and learned the quotation of a few scriptures. That's right. And came out a general. Came out a general. Amen. Came out a sergeant. That's right. And ain't never experienced war in his life. That's right. Amen. It takes God to make Go a ahead. preacher. That's right. Go ahead. Seminary school ain't never made never. preacher. Amen. That's a self-made general. That's right. A self-made sergeant. Amen. In order. For a sergeant to properly train men mm -hmm. about warfare, that's right. He must have some knowledge and experience about warfare. That's right. That's right. Because throwing bags of flour mm -hmm. is not like throwing a hand grenade. No, it's not. No, no. Putting ink in a gun and you shoot spots on somebody. Amen. It's not like having a hole in your chest. That's right. 
going to seminary school, oh, hey. some cheap Baptist college, Amen. or a non-denominational garbage. That's Amen. right. That's and right. coming out talking fancy, Amen. With rings on every finger, every finger. That's that right. That don't qualify you as a preacher. No, 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 no. The preacher must be trained, trained himself by the commander in chief. That's right. His tongue must be trained. That's right. His mind, mind. must be conditioned. That's right. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, yeah. His body must go through hardship That's of right. self denial. That's right. For if he don't deny That's self, himself. he can't tell nobody else to deny themselves. That's right. Amen. Are you listening? Wonderful. Amen. You first must be a student. That's right. Of discipline. That's right. Go ahead. In false religions, anybody can preach. Amen. Anything anybody. can preach. Anybody. That's right. But in God's church, Amen. you must be a student of discipline That's before right. you can teach others how to be disciplined. That's right. Go ahead. Are you listening? Go ahead. Amen. Thou so therefore. when you say discipline, oh, yes. the teaching. Of the apostles, right. once they come in your life, Amen. it comes to revolutionize oh, yes. your mind. That's right. See, we believe in revolution. That's right. That's <laughs> yes, right. Amen. we believe in it. Amen. Not by using a gun. No, no. Not by a knife. No, no. Not by colonel weapons. That's right. We believe in changing the mind and That's hearts right. of the human family. That's right. That's there right. will never be a change in you until Amen. your mind first changes. Right. And right. before your mind can change, you got to hear the right thing to change it. That's right. That's yeah. right. Amen. These cheap religion ain't changing nobody. Don't change it. That's right. Keeping you blind. Amen. It's keeping you deaf. That's right. It's keeping you weak. Amen. It's keeping you prejudiced. Oh, yeah. It's keeping you ignorant. Amen. And it's keeping you in darkness. That's right. Go ahead, take it. That's right. You understand. Oh, yes. So, in order Go ahead. Go ahead. to come out of that Go ahead. undisciplined life Amen. of gang banging, that's right. drug selling, Amen. being extortionist. Amen. Robbing and, stealing, Robbing and stealing, stalking women and stalking men. That's right. Get out of that gay lifestyle. That's right. That's right. Go ahead. Oh yes. Oh yes. You got gays in the army. That's right. Why are you in there? I don't know. That's right. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Because if army's supposed to discipline you. But yet, the private Amen. or the corporal right. is locked up with the sergeant. That's right. That's right. Then what kind of discipline is that? Discipline. Amen. Now let's bring it back to church. Back to the churches. Amen. Church Amen. is supposed to change the people. That's right. That's right. That's right. These churches ain't changing nobody. Amen. You brag because you got a school. Amen. That's right. And you give soup to hungry folk. That's right. Amen. And you give out cheese Without in the cheese. community. Amen. Give them loaves of bread. That's right. What is that? What is that? You Amen. need bread from heaven. Oh, yes. Amen. For what good is going to church? And you still going to stay wild and barbaric Foolish, foolish and a sinner. That's right. Amen. That's right. So when the scripture says, endure hardness oh, as a good soldier of Jesus Christ, Christ. if you want to be made something for God. That's right. So you, we've been something for the devil for years. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Amen. Is that right? Amen. Oh, yes. We've been servants of the devil Servant. too long. That's right. That's right. What you going to do with yourself? Amen. What shall we say? You human family and many of you that are here just stowing yourself away. That's true. That's true. Satan feasts upon you like dogs on a bone. That's right. You know a lot of folk go from man to man, woman to woman because they're seeking to be wanted. That's right. 
they search it. Amen. And they look on the wrong place. That's right. There's nobody can be anything Amen. in your life Amen. equal to God. That's right. Amen. Nobody. Nobody. Amen. That's right. You see, when discipline come in the life of the two-legged male dog. Amen. Amen. He'll start looking at the woman as a woman. That's right. Not as a meat or bone to chew on. That's right. Amen. When the woman stop being a two-legged fox. That's right. Go ahead. Go ahead. Are you listening? Oh, yes. Amen. You will get off the streets of prostitution. That's right. Go ahead. Amen. When brothers belong discipline, they no longer drive around at night to pick up women. That's right. No, they won't. They no longer bump their horn and right. whistle at women. That's right. They no longer look at women up and down and compliment her hips, That's her right. chest, and her thighs. They look at the light. That's right. That's For it. the Bible says your eyes light of the are body. the light of your body. Amen. Wonderful. Are you listening? Amen. When you a good soldier, good soldier. Go ahead. you go through suffering. That's right. And the very suffering you go through Amen. is self-denial. That's right. Self-denial. That's right. Come on, preacher. And that self-denial is something. Isn't it? No more whistling at women. No more trying to flirt with them. That's right. No more trying to give them money to pay them to get in the bed with you. That's right. Am I right? That's right. Amen. Amen. No more walking by patting them on their backside. That's right. You in the military now. That's right. And the hand must be disciplined for the scripture says touch not. not. That's right. No more picking up that bottle of liquor. No more of that. Amen. See you folk in these churches you just go and keep drinking. That's all. You go and get drunk. That's right. You can get the liquor from the preacher. Amen. Amen. No discipline. No discipline. Am I right? That's true. So the scripture says, endure, endure hardness and as a good soldier of Jesus Christ. You got to be a good soldier, good brothers soldier. and sisters. If I'm a good soldier and must learn how to endure, I cannot be afraid of pain. That's right. That's right. You see, the purpose of the military is to train you for war. That's right. Huh? That's right. Now let's get dressed up. Give me the book of Ephesians. Amen. Amen. Let's get the book of Ephesians. In the natural, they train you for war, carnal warfare. Train you how to use the gun, use a bayonet, and use other type of artillery and whatnot. That's right. This type of warfare that you have as a child of God, man or woman. Is a spiritual warfare. Spiritual warfare. That's right. Because as Satan shoot at the flesh, you have to be able to quench Amen. the fiery darts of the wicked. That's right. If someone is going to always run from warfare, they would never know what they're able to endure or overcome. That's right. Are you listening? Amen. Listen at the Bible. In Ephesians chapter 6 and at verse 10. Yeah. Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord. All right. And in the power of his might. Brothers. Mm-hmm. Amen. You must be strong in the Lord. Be strong. That's right. Must be strong. That's right. Not a crybaby. Amen. Amen. You know, when you get in the military, brother, and they throw you that rifle mm-hmm. and tell you to run in place for three hours. Amen. Sergeant don't tolerate no crying. Amen. No, he won't. When you start crying, he's in your ear. That's right. That's right. Hmm? Amen. Amen. You do what? Be strong in the Lord. You have to be strong in the Lord in and, and in the power of his might. 
Amen. It takes God to keep us. Oh, uh, yes. Amen. If God's power don't keep us, we cannot keep ourselves. Amen. That's right. That's Glory right. to God. Amen. In the power of his might, do what? Put on the whole armor of God. You don't need armor if it ain't no war going off. That's right. You need armor, armor. whenever there's a battle. That's right. So there is a battle or a battle. spiritual warfare between you and God. That's right. What is the fight? God say do one thing and your flesh want to do something else. Something else. That's right. But at the same time your flesh want to do something else, yet you still want to be saved. That's right. And want to be right. Amen. But God say no, but your flesh say yes, so it's war. It's war. That's right. <laughs> huh? That's right. It's an argument. Oh, yes. Let us see what fights we have. Amen. Galatians chapter 5. In Galatians chapter 5 and at verse 17. Here are the explosions. All right, verse 19. The bombs that Satan drop on the flesh. Now the works of the flesh. What is it? Are manifest. Which are these? What? Adultery. Adultery. That's mm -hmm. a large hand grenade. Large hand. Amen. Because sometimes you get some silly husband. That's right. Who ain't acting right. Amen. Beating you. Punching you. That's right. Stomping on you. Amen. And you ain't no man if you beat a woman. That's true. That's right. Those four, if I got any woman beaters sitting here. That's right. You ain't no man you beat some woman. No, no. No, no. Go ahead. You grab some woman and push up against the wall. Against the wall. Amen. Smack some woman around. That's right. Brag about your manhood. That's not the act of a man. No, no. That's an act of an uncivilized man. That's right. That's right. What did he say? Now the works of the flesh are manifest. Which are these? Adultery. These are the works of the flesh that brings argument with God. Amen. For God said, let every man have his own wife. But hear that bomb hit you. Adultery. That's right. Oh, yeah. And there's that two legged bomb. Yes. Amen. <laughs> you understand? Amen. And being that the Lord said, let every man have his own wife. Own wife. You sometimes you get a wife and she's the devil. That's right. Take your time, preacher. Then you meet a woman mm -hmm. who can meet up to the proper criteria that you want. That's right. But because you already got a devil. That's right. And the Lord said you're bound by the law as long as you live. That's right. That's right. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Amen. You just got to keep the devil. Keep it. Amen. Or mm -hmm. the Bible justifies separation. separation. That's right. You can't get that woman that's just that prize when you already married. If you do, adultery. you fell into adultery. That's right. There's commit adultery, then there's living in, in, in adultery. Uh, yeah. That's right. Commit adultery, you ain't living with the woman. You just committed something with her. That's all. Living, you actually got the extra woman. You live in there. Yeah, that's right. Am I right? That's right. <laughs> Amen. What did he say? Adultery. Adultery. Fornication. You get a female soldier. Amen. Want to serve God. Want to serve God. Hear this hardcore truth. Oh, yeah. Then go back home and look at the man that's the man of her dreams, but that's is right. not the man by right. That's right. Everything she wanted in man is right there. Amen. Take care of it. Amen. She work because she want to, not because she have to. That's right. That's right. Huh? Amen. Buy her flowers. My Lord. Massage her big feet. My Lord. <laughs> Amen. Buy her house. Amen. Buy her own car. My Lord. She work because she don't want to be bored, but she don't have to. Have to. That's right. But yet, there's the first husband. Mm. Still living. Still there. Amen. Somewhere. That's right. Somehow. That's right. And if I want to be saved, Amen. the war that I fight so, with My Lord. 
is the fact I don't want my first husband. Amen. Because he just will not respect me and treat me right. Mm -hmm. I don't want to go back to him and I can't keep him. That's right. Because he ain't mine. That's right. My Lord. And if I live a neutral life, my Lord. I got to go through the pain of what my body going to go through. Amen. Of not having no man with it. That's right. So I'm at war. War. Amen. Amen. Decision one. Mm -hmm. Go back to him mm -hmm. if you want him. Amen. Or mm -hmm. decision two. Stay single, stay single and serve God. That's right. Decision three must be made to be saved. Amen. You got to get rid of the second one. That's right. That's right. I know. That bomb got a lot of smoke. Yes, it does. And I'm telling you, the crater where it hit, I, I see know. bodies everywhere. That's right. That's right. You got to endure hardness as a good soldier. good soldier. Amen. What did he say there? Adultery. Adult? Fornication. What? Fornication. That's another bomb. Bomb. Too much loving going on. Big bomb. Amen. Huh? That's right. Amen. That's right. Don't blame me for what's in the Bible. Oh, uh, yes. It's my job to preach it. Amen. I can never decide what to preach. No, no. No more can the male man decide what male he gonna carry. That's right. He's giving it. The bag is full. Amen. He got to go out. That's right. Are you listening? Amen. Fornication. Fornication. The man that's not your husband, the woman that's not your wife. That's right. What is the war there? Mm -hmm. Here you have a body. Mm -hmm. Here you have a body. Mm -hmm. A man or a woman. Amen. Single. Amen. Start growing up. Mm -hmm. Now they're worn with the feelings of Born. self. That's right. And the desire of self. That's right. And here you're talking about repenting of your sins. My Lord. Being baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Seeking the Lord for the Holy Ghost. That's right. Then receive it. Mm -hmm. Yet not marry. Amen. But the devil ain't going to make that single woman look ugly to you. That's right. That's right. Huh? No, no. So where does the war come in at? Amen. <laughs> where does the conflict come in at? Amen. Because you know you want her. Mm -hmm. Don't you? That's right. You want to look at her. Go ahead. Don't you? Go ahead. Talk back to me. Go ahead. Go ahead. You want to sleep with her? My Lord. My Lord. Amen. Amen. This is a war. It's a war. Amen. You want to spend the night with her? Amen. You want to take her out to dinner? That's right. There's a lot of things you want to say to her? Oh, yeah. That's right. But the denial of self nah. makes you refrain from that lifestyle. Amen. And to prove that you're in a war, mm -hmm. sometimes you will lose some matches of fighting. That's right. You fight for a while. That's true. Then before you know it, you lost a match. That's right. That's Enemy right. shot you. Right. Amen. Then you're gonna have you're wounded. wounded. That's true. You are casualty of war now. That's right. <laughs> That's right. So you gotta be picked up and regroup. Amen. So I say, well, Pastor Jennings, I'm doing pretty good. I ain't, I ain't touching a woman since I came this way. Just a minute. Just a minute. Just a minute. Amen. You can touch a woman without the hands. Without the hands. That's right. That's right. You can touch a man without your hands. That's right. And I say unto you. The Bible says in Matthew chapter 5 and verse 28. I say unto thee that whosoever whosoever look it. What? Look it. Whosoever do what, brother? Look it. Do what? Look it. Do what? Look it. Whosoever look it. Look it on a woman. On a woman to lust to after her. Lust after her. That's it. That's it. Two. You ain't say just look at a woman. No. No, no. But you're looking at a woman with the intent and a purpose. That's right. 
That's right. There's something in you towards her. That's right. Whosoever looketh on a woman, looketh on the woman, to lust after to her, lust mm -hmm. after her. You want her. Want her. Mm -hmm. In your mind, you already on your way. That's right. What is it? Whosoever looketh on a woman to lust, to after, lust her, after her hath committed adultery, hath committed adultery already, already in his heart. Didn't do it later. That's right. Already. Got you already. Already. If you're single, My Lord. and not married, Amen. you commit a fornication already. Already. That's, huh? right. That's right. Even when the service is over and you embrace the sister. And there you are lusting after her after that embrace. Amen. And you want her body. You Amen. already had it. Already had it in his heart. Even if you never touch her. That's right. That's why in order to be a soldier, your mind must be disciplined. When a man come off the street and join the military, he can't fight a war like a hoodlum. That's right. No, no. When a man serve God and come from being a sinner, he can't walk with God as a sinner. No, no. Oh, no. So therefore, his mind must go through alteration. That's right. That's right. Change That's take right. place. Change. Amen. Amen. Such discipline is upon him, he can look at a woman respectfully. That's right. That's right. No more whistling at her. Amen. No more howling like a fox or wolf. That's right. He'll respect another man's wife. That's right. Amen. Am I right? Oh, yes. Amen. Amen. Works of the flesh. Move quick. Now the works of the flesh are manifest which are these. What is it? Adultery. Yes. Fornication. What else? Uncleanness. Uncleanness. Amen. See, we your civilian life viewer and listener, mm -hmm. you that are here, mm -hmm. you had your penthouse magazines. That's right. Didn't you? Yes, sir. Oh, yeah. You had your Playboy. Yes, Amen. Yes, Amen. You know I'm telling the truth. That's right. Sit and look at me like you don't know what I'm talking about. That's right. Amen. Some of you women have Playgirl. Oh, yeah. That's true. That's right. Yeah. Amen. Yes. But that sin mm -hmm. is not greater than having Playboy. No, it's not. No, it's not. The point is, when you were the civilian, you was a sinner. That's right. Are you listening? That's true. Yeah. Uncleanliness. Uncleanness. So Amen. when I got a mind to walk with God, I want to be a good soldier now of Jesus Christ. Amen. <clears throat> I got to clean up. Clean up. Huh? Right. That's right. Got Not this artificial army. See, when yeah. I was little, I had toy army men. That's right. You religions are like toy army men. Amen. Amen. You know, you go to the Catholic church and go in the closet and tell the priest something for five minutes. He says seven Hail Marys. That's right. Hail Mary, Hail Mary, Hail Mary, Hail Mary, Hail Mary, Hail Mary. Then you go out. Go out. Feeling good because you got something off your chest with a pipe in your mouth. That's true. That's right, sir. That's right. And after you're done, make your confession. The priest is going to take a break and he's stoned. Amen. Amen. Or either he got the other priest sleeping with him in the next closet. That's right. That's toy true. army. Toy army. Amen. Toy soldiers. Oh, uh, yeah. You understand? Amen. If you talking about being a man or a woman of God, reality. Reality. Oh, uh, yeah. Then you must submit. That's right. To the hardness mm -hmm. and the discipline of God. That's right. No shortcuts. No, no. No cheating. That's right. Nothing on the side. Amen. It's straight up with you and God. That's right. If no. it's not going to be straight up with you and God, just yeah. quit all together. That's right. Quit. Where does the straight upness start at? With yourself. That's right. Gotta be honest with myself. That's true. I gotta admit the self habits that I have. That's right. Huh? That's right. Because of the sheer hypocrisy for a saint to go in another saint house, then you gotta hide the beer. Go ahead. But you forget the Lord see you all the time, all the time. anyway. That's right. That's saint right. come to your house, you hide your dirty magazines. Amen. Or you hide your girlfriend. That's right. Or you hide your boyfriend. Amen. 
or you hide the clothes that got your stain on them? My Lord. Talk back Go to ahead. me. Go ahead. Go ahead. True discipline My Lord. is obedience. Obedience, that's right. And if we serve God in true holiness, Amen. we've got somebody to obey. Oh, uh, yes. In order to be a soldier right, you got to be able to take orders. Take orders. Yeah. yeah. That's right. It ain't no soldier is a good soldier until he's able to take orders. That's right. Can't come and go when he please. No, no. no got to take instructions. Take instructions. That's right. <laughs> you That's understand? Right. That's right. He got to follow orders and submit and obey them. That's right. Right. He got to take the proof. Take the proof. Amen. When the Lord reproved you for drinking and said wine is a mocker. That's right. When the Lord reproved you for smoking and says cleanse yourself from all filthiness of the flesh. Amen. When the Lord reproved you for cursing you the profanity. That's right. Then the prophet said let not arrogancy come out of your mouth. Amen. Amen. Then Solomon said don't be rash with your mouth. mouth. That's right. Go ahead. The Lord reproved you for your conduct. That's right. You must submit. Amen. And say not my will. That's right. But let thine will be done. Yes. Good soldier. You got to be a good soldier. Good soldier. Amen. Now one is a good soldier. When your jacket or your skirt used to be the length of my jacket. That's right. With a split in that. Amen. My Lord. Good soldier. You see, you are a uniform. Out of uniform. That's right. You got to get the right uniform right. on. Amen. Bible says cover up the shame, shame of your neck. That's right. For when you got to reveal your hips and your backside and your calves and your thighs and your breasts and your bare arms. Amen. Just to get attention. Amen. What you got attention from ain't worth having. That's right. That's right. Amen. If she's already used to being buck naked in the streets. My Lord. She's undisciplined. That's right. Now for her to serve God, she got to learn the very act of discipline of just putting clothes on. That's right. That's right. Huh? Amen. She got to put clothes on now. Clothes up and raise up. That's right. That's right. No more mini skirts. No, no. Everything is dropped down like a curtain. That's right. That's right. She's not dying her hair. No, no. She's not buying somebody else's hair. That's right. Amen. 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 No more plucking her eyebrows. No, you no. too, mister. That's true. That's no true. more earrings. That's right. No more finger bracelets and all these jewelry and getting manicures. Amen. Amen. No more fishnet stockings. No, no. No ankle chains wearing the label of a whore. That's right. That's right. Tire of a whore. Making vain jangling with your feet. That's right. Go ahead. Put on the attire of a harlot. Harlot. That's right. Out of uniform. Out of uniform. That's right. Are you listening? Amen. Amen. If you want God to dress you up, He said, put on. Put on. The whole arm of God, armor of God, that he may be able to stand. That he may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. Uh, the devil's a wild thing. Wiles, amen. Against the wiles of the devil, then what? For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world. What else? Against spiritual wickedness in high places. Uh -huh. Wherefore, take unto you the whole armor of God, brothers and sisters. We need to be properly protected. Properly protected. Amen. Amen. Armor is protection. That's right. You out there looking at me and listening to us around the world, you have no protection. No protection. None. Amen. What can protect you other than God? That's right. You got three gods. Which one of them are protecting you? That's right. You got some statue in your house supposed to be God. Amen. Some clay. That's right. Statue can't even clean the bird droppings off itself. That's true. You know you can't do nothing for me. Amen. Hello. What did he say? Wherefore, take unto you the whole, the whole arm, of God, arm of God, that ye may be able to withstand in the evil day. Move quick. And having done all to stand, 
Stand therefore having your loins. After you've done everything to stand, stand when it there. get harder, don't right. AWOL. That's it. That's right. Don't backslide. That's right. Stand there. You got to endure and hang in there and just come up to what the Bible said. That's right. Huh? Amen. You got to come up to what the Bible said. That's right. When God laid down law, mm -hmm. the law is not to be compromised with. No, no. God laid down the law. We must come up to the law. That's right. It is not coming down to us. We must come up to it. Amen. What did he say? And having done all to stand, stand therefore. Yes. Having your loins girt about with truth. All right. Amen. Your loins must be girt about with truth. Amen. That's right. Anything that's girdled is supported. Supported. Truth, Truth is the girdle of the saints. Righteousness. Listen at the scripture. In Isaiah chapter eleven and at verse five. Righteousness shall be the girdle. Shall be the girdle of his loins. Of his loins. And faithfulness. Faithfulness. The girdle of his reins. You need truth oh, yeah. to girdle that man and girdle that woman. That's right. And once they're properly governed or tied down to truth, it gives their body a chance to react. To what has them tied down. That's right. By obeying the same. That's right. What did he say? Having your loins girt about with truth. Yeah. And having on the breastplate of righteousness. Now you need chest protection. Chest protection. Right. Why your chest need protection? Because there's a heart there. That's right. And the Bible says the heart is the most deceitful thing. Amen. Now, if you don't have a breastplate on, mm -hmm. what is the breastplate that protects the chest? Mm -hmm. Knowledge. Knowledge. Amen. Wisdom. And understanding. That's right. It protects your heart. That's right. Because once you're properly informed, you know how or what to keep your heart from sinking into. That's if right. You give in to the discipline of the scriptures. Amen. Now you got another war of war. It's another war. But when your heart sees something good, you want it. That's true. That's right. Am I right? That's right. Anytime somebody sees something mm -hmm. and it looks good to them. Good to them. It start their heart begin to desire it. That's right. And then they pursue it. Mm -hmm. That's right. So the scripture says, and having on the breastplate of righteousness. The purpose of having a breastplate so when Satan fire at your heart. That's right. You have some chest protection. Amen. Huh? Amen. Then your heart won't be broken ever so often. That's true. That's right. Come on, son. And your feet shod with the preparation of the gospel of peace. You know, when you go in the military, they go through stepping. Amen. Doesn't matter whether you're wing footed, pigeon toed. Amen. They go through stepping, the mark time. The, time. the whole objective is to make everybody unified. That's right. Everyone wearing the same thing. That's right. The Bible says your feet must be shod with the, with the preparations of the, of the gospel. gospel of peace. The word of God prepare your feet how to walk, how to listeners walk. and viewers. Amen. The Bible says a good man's steps ordered by are the Lord. ordered by the Lord. You see, if the Lord don't have your steps, you will go anywhere. Yes, you would. That's why when the Lord didn't have your steps, you was in the bar all night. That's right. The bar clown. That's right. The loudest thing in there. Amen. Ready to fight anyone that look at you. That's true. Some of you women with the same thing. Same way, amen. It's a disgrace to see a drunken man. It is more of a disgrace to see a drunken woman. That's right. Cursing That's right. and hollering like a man. Amen. Call one another a bee. That's true. That's right. Ready to pull out a blade or a gun to shoot or stab. Amen. Lay with five men that night and don't remember the first one. My Lord. My Lord. Oh, hey. Are you listening? That's right. You don't see nothing wrong with stopping something you love. Amen. You first got to see what's wrong with it. That's right. That's right. And to see what's wrong with it, you got to have an interest of what interests God. Amen. When you find out what interests God and you become interested, then change begin to be made. That's right. What did he say? And your feet shod with the preparation of the gospel of peace. Yes, you see, you got to be able to step right now. Step right. Oh, the yeah. time you used to step to men. Amen. That's right. Huh? That's right. Now your feet is shod in another direction. That's right. That's right. Amen. Brother, the time you used to step to women. Mm -hmm. Almost like a jet. 
That's right. That's right. Amen. You understand? Amen. Go ahead. There's no more calling some single woman baby, honey, sweetheart, and all these pet names. That's right. You call her by the name she has. That's right. You want to give a pet name, give it to your wife. Amen. You ain't got no wife, you ain't got no pet. No pets. Amen. You want a pet, go to the SPCA somewhere. That's right. Get a dog or a little cat. Go ahead. Call Fluff. Amen. My Lord. Are you listening? That's right. That's right. Only the word of God make a man of a man. Amen. And make a true woman out of a woman. That's right. Your ability to hang three hours in a bed is not proof you a man or a woman. No, it's not. You have no monopoly upon reproducing. That's right. Dogs and insects do it every day. That's true. Go ahead. Are you listening to the old troublemaker? Amen. What did he say? And your feet shod with the preparation of the gospel of peace. Yes. Above all. Above all? Taking the shield of faith. Wherewith ye shall be able to quench all the fiery darts. You know when you get a shield. Mm -hmm. It is no good laying down. Amen. Amen. You must take it. Take it up. And use it. That's right. And you don't need it if you're not being shot at. That's true. That's right. What is my shield of faith? My belief and confidence in God. That's right. And I must take God and present him first and foremost in my life. Amen. And let the decisions I make in life revolve around God. That's right. And if my decisions revolve around God, Amen. my personal feelings get out of it. That's true. Oh, you know that's a sad war. Yes, it is. Because if you gonna let your life revolve around God, yeah, Lord. God is more no about things than yes. yes Amen. Sir. That's true. And sometimes we try to take God's lips. And try to restructure them. That's right. That's right. You know, sometimes when someone say no, you grab the lip. You don't really know. You shake their head. That's right. That's the way folk do the scriptures, you know. Amen. The scripture says, know this, know that. And a fool will come along and say, it don't mean that. That's right. Trying to shake the lips. It don't mean that every man have his own wife. It don't mean that. Amen. It means that uh, 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 you're not supposed to overindulge. See, you, you, you sin a little, but don't overindulge. That's right. And then a false prophet say, are you praying with me? Amen. That's right. No, I ain't praying with you, liar. Amen. Go the ahead. Bible says all unrighteousness sin. is sin. All Oh. And before you look at the sin in anyone else, Amen. you must first I'll be honest and recognize nice. the sin that is in self. That's right. That's right. When you're going to take Got your it. own sin mm -hmm. and ignore it Amen. as if it don't exist, Amen. you are no help to no brother or no sister. That's true. All right. Above all, taking the shield of faith, yes. wherewith ye shall be able to quench able all to the fiery quench. darts of the wicked. Satan got some fiery darts. Fiery darts. Fiery darts mean that which have power. That's right. Huh? Oh yeah. You know, sometimes when a man hunting wild game, he use what is called a tranquilizer. Amen. And the purpose of the tranquilizer is to compete, or rather, to overthrow your strength. That's right. It mobilizes you. Amen. Paralyze your nerves. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter if you're a rhinoceros. Oh, no. When a tranquilizer get a hold of you, you can be pet just easy as a cat. That's true. Satan? That's right. Have fiery darts. Fiery darts. Amen. A tranquilizing darts shot at the mind of the people of God. That's right. For if the scripture says, let this mind be in you, that's also in Christ Jesus. That's right. And if I'm running, my feet is shot. That's right. 
I mean, step walking on a street in narrow way. Amen. Satan is like a sniper. That's right. Sometimes you don't even see him. Go ahead. Or what he gonna hit you with? Amen. But he see you on the highway Amen. of holiness. That's right. And he shoots you. But the Bible said the very thoughts of foolishness is sin. That's right. So he shoots you. That's right. Right at the mind. Right at the mind. Because the Bible said, let this mind be in you. Amen. That's also in Christ Jesus. But if I don't have his mind, his mind, I'm in sin. That's true. That's right. So if Satan can give me another mind, the tranquilizer will begin to work on my body. Amen. Huh? That's right. Because sin don't start with the act. No. Sin start with the thought. thought. That's right. Been doing good for a while. That's right. Go downtown in the summertime, been doing good. Amen. Go take care of your business and go home. That's right. Walk in the street in narrow way. That's right. Next thing you know, fiery dart shot. Fiery darts. Amen. There was just one pair of shorts too short for you. That's right. That's true. Huh? Amen. Tranquilizer hit you. Tranquilizer got you. <laughs> you understand? Oh, yeah. Amen. And when you're walking on that straight and narrow way, that Amen. tranquilizer hits you, you stagger. Stagger you. Huh? That's right. Another tranquilizer. Another woman walked by. Been shot again. That's right. Stagger. Amen. Now it's going to affect your eyes and besides seeing one way. Amen. Now swerving. you start to see a fork road. That's right. That's you right. start swerving. Swerving. Especially if she's calling you, come down with us. That's right. She wants to do you as she thinks some good. That's right. Go ahead. Go ahead. Are you listening? Amen. Religion is just like drugs. Yes, it is. It's a big hype. That's all. Get you all high and you jump around That's in right. some false church. That's right. Until you come down to reality. Amen. This truth right here is a detox center. Yes, it is. We come to undo That's what right. the devil done. That's right. So you've been jumping and shouting and holding neighbors' hands for years oh, yeah. with no knowledge of God. That's right. And when you don't know God, you don't know self. That's right. The very knowledge of God is the introduction to yourself. That's right. Hello. For when I come into the knowledge of who God is, Amen. Then God will bring me to the knowledge of who I am. That's right. And when God brings me to the knowledge of who I am, that I am an adopted child. That's right. Who's a servant of the Father? That's right. Then I begin to learn why I'm here. Amen. I made you glory to God my for glory. my glory. That's right. You begin to find out why you're existing. Amen. God made you to live for Him. That's right. You want to sing, sing for Him. Amen. You want to pray to a God, pray to the God Amen. of heaven. That's right. The Lord of the world. That's right. And Jesus Christ is here. Amen. Wonderful. If you don't have no family, God will give you one. Yes, he will. Hello. Huh? Amen. He won't give you a family with four religions under one roof. Oh, no. A no, back no. to sleep with a Presbyterian. No, no. Raising a Catholic. That's right. And sending a, a, a non-denomination of the college. That's right. Under God's roof, one truth. One truth. Amen. What do we have to introduce to you, folk? For the first time Amen. on television, Amen. God's religion. That's right. God's, That's God's right. religion. God's religion. You have been exposed right. to everybody else's religion Amen. but God's. But God's. You have been exposed to Roger Williams' religion. That's right. John Wesley. Amen. Henry Price. Amen. Master Farad Muhammad. That's right. You have been exposed to everybody self-made religion but God. God's religion. God's religion. God's religion have a name. Yes, it does. Oh, it's a God. Yes, it does. And whatever the name of God religion is, go ahead. You must be whatever he is. Whatever he is. That's right. Let's find out what he is and what he told us to be. First Peter chapter 1 and at verse 16. First Peter 1 16. Because it is written. It is written. Be ye holy. The Lord's head was talking. Lord talk. The Lord said, Be ye holy. For I for I am, am holy. Let's see how long 
It was predestinated. Someone said, well, when did your religion start? It has no beginning. No beginning. That's right. No beginning. For if God is holy. Amen. And he tell us to be holy. That's right. There is no beginning to God. No beginning to God. That's and right. if there is no beginning to God, there is no beginning to what God believes. That's right. Go ahead. You just had to come into existence. Amen. To find out That's what right. do God believe. That's right. Go ahead. The founder of Go our ahead. religion has no beginning That's of right. day. That's right. He has no end of life. Go ahead. He made the world. Amen. But he did not make a bunch of religion. No, he didn't. You no, can't no. find Baptists in the Bible. No, no. So you have no right to be Baptist. That's right. You can't find non-denominational in the Bible. That's right. You have no right to be non-denominational. That's right. You can't find Catholics in the Bible. Amen. You have no right to be right. Catholic. That's right. You can't find the nation of Islam in the Bible. Go ahead. You have no right. right. Amen. Go ahead. Go ahead. No right. No right. Amen. No wish up Master Farad Muhammad. My Lord, no right to do that. You can't find the Ku Klux Klan racist trash no. in the Bible. No, no. Go ahead. You have no right burning crosses talking about white supremacy. That's right. That supremacy is of hell. Amen. Oh, yeah. There's only one religion. One religion. One religion. That I pick up from Old Testament, Old Testament. all the way to New. All the way to the New. Give me the book of Leviticus. In Leviticus chapter 19 and at verse 1. You Bible scholars say God first religion was Judaism. Right. Then he changed to Christianity. That's right. But the one God say I'm a God that changes not. That's right. That's right. He have one law. Amen. For the world. That's right. I don't care if you're black as ashes, white as snow, yellow as butter, or clear as water. You got to come to God's way. That's right. These TV evangelists' way are messengers of hell. Yes, they are. They are deceivers. That's right. They are businessmen. That's right. That take the name Jesus in the title church and make a racket. That's right. We come to break up the racket. Break it up. Amen. Break it up. Amen. Amen. We're going to break up the rap. Break it up. That's right. In the late 20s, they put out a law or 30s prohibition. Amen. <laughs> oh, yeah. No liquor was allowed in America. That's right. It was banned. Amen. But sometimes you have a bootlegging operation. Oh, yes. When liquor was smuggled. That's right. But the law was being broken. Amen. That's what you leave religions represent. Uh -huh. Bootlegging. Bootleggers. Because you're smuggling in lies. That's right. When truth was here before any of you ever started. Amen. Amen. Truth was already here. So when the G man or the government man. That's right. Found out there was an unlawful still operating. Uh -huh. They came and kicked the door down. That's right. Got the axe. Amen. Break up the liquor still. Up. That's right. We got the axe. Got the axe now. Amen. We're going to break up your religion. That's right. If you put a contract out. Go ahead. We ain't running from nobody. That's right. From the White House to the dog house. That's right. Go ahead. Religion had to see and that go for you apostolic fakers as well. Amen. Go for them too. You have became nothing but gay churches. That's all. Lesbian women. That's right. Cotton stocking whores. That's right. My Lord. White socks and black suit playboys. That's right. My Lord. Are you listening to me? Amen. What did he say there? In Leviticus chapter 19 and at verse 1. What is it? And the Lord spake unto Moses. The said, Lord said to Moses. Speak unto all the speak congregation. Speak to all the congregation. Of the children of Israel. Of the children of Israel. And say unto them. What? Ye shall be holy. Ye shall be Baptist. Ye shall be holy. Ye shall be Mormon. Ye shall be holy. Ye shall be non-denomination. Ye shall be holy. Ye shall be Catholic. Ye shall be holy. Ye shall be what, brethren? Holy. What? Holy. What? Holy. What is that? Holy. Talk to me. Holy. That's right. That's right. You gotta be holy. Yes, Lord. Amen. Amen. He 
even before God created the world, Amen. the very purpose for the world was established. In Ephesians chapter yeah, one, one thing about this telecast, we do what preachers don't do. We give you a Bible for every right. grunt. That's right. I don't have no prepared sermon. No, no. It was here before I was born. That's right. Eh? That's right. Listen at the Bible. Ephesians chapter one and Ephesians verse four. Ephesians chapter one, the book of Ephesians chapter one, verse four. According as he hath chosen oh, us in him. Oh, how sweet this is. Amen. According as he hath chosen us as God have chosen us in him in him before before the foundation of the world before the world was what was God's purpose for us that we should be holy plain amen, amen. that's what make me talk like I do that's right that's right before the Hallelujah. foundation of the world Hallelujah. amen before the mountains lift amen. their nose towards him amen Holiness was here. That's right. Before a firmament was placed in the midst of the deep, holiness started to Amen. It was here. That's right. Should be. Before the Lord rode on the wings of the wind. That's right. And made the clouds a chariot. That's right. And set out the heavens as a curtain. That's right. Holiness was here. That's right. No, no, no. We are not a denomination. No, no. We are God's That's right. religion. That's it. God's religion is pure. That's right. God's religion is clean. That's right. Because the religion of God is the reflection of God Himself. That's right. Wonderful. So how can you be Christian? Wonderful. And smoke it. That's right. You That's don't right. reflect God reflect with a God. cigarette. No, no. You don't reflect God being in a motorcycle gang. That's right. You don't reflect God walking the streets half naked. That's right. Go ahead. Go ahead. You don't reflect God calling me a nigga. That's right. Preach it. Talk back to Preach me. It. That's right. Amen. I don't reflect God calling you a cracker. That's right. No, no. No, no. You don't reflect God having a white man hang on your wall That's supposed right. to be Jesus. Amen. And you don't reflect God having a black man supposed to be Jesus. That's right. You don't reflect God praying in some church garden to Mary. That's right. We shall pray to God and God. God Himself. Amen. Wonderful. There is no God Good teacher. Good teacher. but the Almighty. That's right. That's right. Go to God. Uh, None. None. Amen. Your religions don't have no God. Have no God. And you wonder why I can bust your religion up. That's right. So easy. That's right. God is the source. That's right. Hallelujah. That's right. God is the source Amen. of our belief. That's right. Go ahead. Anytime you don't have God Go ahead. Go ahead. behind what you believe, what, doing. what you got ain't worth having. That's right. For all the gods of the nations. Right. Listen at the Bible. In Psalms 96 and verse 5. All the gods of the nations, of the nations are idols. They are idols. But the Lord. But the Lord made the heavens. Hallelujah. 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 Amen. Amen. The Lord Hallelujah. Amen. made the heavens. Amen. Hallelujah. I don't want no God Hallelujah. who's confined Hallelujah. to saving just black folks. Hallelujah. 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 I don't want no like that. Hallelujah. 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 Did you Hallelujah. folks looking at me hear what I said? My Lord. I don't Amen. want no God no, no. who's so weak. That's right. He only can save black folk. That's right. I equally don't want no God that's so weak. He Amen. only can save white folk. That's right. That's right. I need a God. That's right. That when I call on him, go ahead, go ahead, Hallelujah. go ahead, 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 that's right. It doesn't matter where he's at. No, no. Where I'm located in the world, Amen. I have to reach him. Reach him. That's right. I That's don't right. have to see him. No, no. But I know he exists. That's right. You don't see Michelangelo. No, no. But you see his artwork. That's right. You know that he once exists. That's right. When I look up and see the heavens. That's right. That's right. When I see the moon. That's right. When I see the earth. Amen. And the heavens just moving. That, amen. You scientists say it moved on his axles. That's right. But the Bible says he hung the earth on nothing. That's right. 
Amen. And ain't nothing holding that up but God. That's it. That's right. Go you ahead. take your little idol God. Go ahead. Whether it's Buddha. Amen. Or Confucius. That's right. Or some heavy Christian garbage. That's right. You take your God and dump, dump it. it. Amen. Amen. For the Lord is great. If you're not serving. Amen. The God of the prophets. Go ahead. Go ahead. The God of the apostles. That's right. And That's that right. I may add my God. That's right. Go ahead. Who plainly told Saul, Amen. I am Jesus. That's what he said. Whom by persecuting, and today in religion, you're persecuting no. God. That's right. Oh, yes, you are. Oh, yeah. How are you persecuting God by your sinful nature? That's right. Your hard head. Amen. You're stubborn. Oh, yes. You're rebellious. Amen. And the moment you get in trouble, you go pray to the one you disobey. That's right. And yet he comes show mercy. That's what he does. Even upon the unjust. That's right. That's true. God don't owe us nothing. No, he don't. We owe him everything. Him everything. That's right. My Lord. He don't owe us nothing. No, no. You looking in my face, God don't owe you nothing. That's right. Teach him. He got you breathing. Teach him. Amen. Still won't obey him. That's true. He blessed you with a job. That's right. Still won't obey him. Amen. Got food in your mouth. Oh, yeah. Roof over your head. Amen. Clothes on your back. That's right. But you're so arrogant. Amen. And wicked. That's right. And self-righteous. That's right. You don't have enough in you. Amen. You won't obey him. That's right. But until you get in trouble. Oh, yeah. Bed stricken. That's true. Now you want to call some oh, priest. Oh. Amen. Now what can oh, he do? What can he do? That's right. You call some priest. Amen. Who got a rosary chain and a jar of Vaseline. My Lord. What can he do for you? That's right. Nothing, That's nothing. but be in hell with you. That's right. Amen. Are you listening to the old troublemaker? Amen. What did he say here? Thou therefore endure hardness. Endure hardness. As a good soldier of Jesus Christ. This is boot camp. Boot camp. Amen. God's true church is a training center. That's right. To take men and women That's right. and turn them into divine soldiers. That's right. That's right. And put decency in the prostitute. That's true. And put respect in the whore. That's right. That's right. And sober up the alcoholic. That's right. Amen. And discipline the hands of thieves. Oh, yes. Amen. It chastised the murderers. That's right. Amen. You did take the white man and black man and make them embrace one another. That's true. That's right. Even after you raised to hate one another. That's right. Amen. God had an army, viewer. God got an army. And this is not all the God's army. No, it's not. God's army is as the sands of the sea. That's right. For the apostle said, I saw a number. Amen. No man that no man could no number. Man could That's right. These were they arrayed in red and white robes. That's right. They had palms in their hands. That's right. Wonderful. You want to be a part of God's family? Wonderful. You got to repent. That's it. Bible ain't tell you pray a sinner's prayer. No, the no. Bible ain't tell you join no church. No, no. The Bible didn't tell you accept Christ where you sit at. That's the right. Bible didn't tell you none of that God. None of that. That's right. Until you do it the Bible way, you ain't got it right. That's right. You just go to church. Go to church. Or what that's called church. That's right. When yeah. you do it right, you repent. You repent. You are sorry about your wrong. That's right. You know, you can do wrong and then jump be baptized, but you're never sorry about your wrong. That's true. A man who is sorry, he's convicted. That's right. Understanding brings about conviction. That's right. You become grieved for the sin you've done. Amen. For the ones you mistreated. That's right. When the time you sold drugs, even though the Lord delivers you, the very thought of you used to do such a thing grieves you. That's right. The repentance never leave your heart. That's true. That's right. But it must be there. Be there. Amen. Then you go down in water, yeah, not to a little bowl, no, no. and be sprinkled by a priest. That's right. Not hold some preacher's hand, hand and repeat a sinner's prayer. No, no. Not touch a television and ask God to come in your heart. Only thing you get is a warm hand from tubes. That's right. That's right. Please don't think you're too cute to obey God. 
No, no. Don't think you got too much money, mister. That's right. Don't not obey God. That's right. The beautiful die like the ugly. Amen. And the young is buried just like the old. That's right. Are you listening? Amen. Come on, son. Thou therefore endure hardness as a good soldier of Jesus Christ. Once I repent. Amen. And become convicted in godless sorrow of my wrong. That's right. Then I must be baptized, baptized. in water. Amen. The Bible way. The Bible way. The Bible way is not sprinkled. That's not the book. It's not the book. No, it's not. This dry, clean salvation don't need no water. That's right. Some old lying preacher told you baptism is an outward sign grace. of inward grace. You can't tell us nothing unless you can read it. That's right. And that's not in the book. No, it's not. That's an outward lie told by an inward demon. That's right. That's right. Are you listening? Amen. You must be baptized in water in the name of oh, Jesus, Jesus Christ. Christ. Amen. Which is the name of God. That's right. That's right. When I'm baptized in the name of Jesus Christ, Amen. I obtain the name of God. Oh, that's right. That's God's name. God's name. Amen. God's name is not Buddha. No, it's not. No, it's not. God's name is not Confucius. That's right. God's name is not Farrakhan. God's name is not Tell Elijah it. Muhammad. That's right. Tell Tell it. It. Wonderful. That's not God's name. Not his name. That's right. Give me Psalms. 100. Or rather, give me a Acts. Acts. 759. That's right. Let's see what should we say if we call on God. Acts chapter 7 and verse 59. Acts chapter 7 verse 59. And they stoned Stephen. They stoned Stephen. Calling upon God. Calling upon who? Calling upon God. Calling upon who? Calling upon God. By what name? And saying Lord Jesus. That's it. Only God is the true Messiah. True. Only God. That's right. You out there say Farrakhan. That's right. Is the Messiah. Amen. That's what you're saying. Who's Messiah? Who's Messiah? Then you may call yourself a Messiah. Amen. But God is the Amen. Messiah. John chapter 4. The only true deliverer of man. That's true. That's true. Listen at the book of John chapter 4. And at verse 25. Yes. The woman saith unto him. The woman saith to Jesus. I know that Messiah cometh. I know that Messiah cometh. Which is called Christ. Which is called Farrakhan. Which is called Christ. I know that Messiah cometh which is called Muhammad. Which is called Christ. I know that Messiah is coming which is called Buddha. Which is called Christ. Reverend Moon. Called Christ. Amen. When he is come. He will tell us all things. Jesus saith unto her, I, I that speak unto thee, that speak unto you, am he. I'm the one. That's right. That's right. Amen. He's the one. He's the one. That's right. That's right. He's the one. Are you listening? Amen. Amen. So when you repent of your sins and your whole body go down in the water. Amen. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Amen. Only that will wash away your sins. That's right. All this other junk you ain't got the churches, you ain't got nothing. No, no. Just went through vain formality. That's all. It ain't no such thing. You have your religion and I have mine. What kind of foolish talk is that? Amen. You think the one God of heaven stole millions. My Lord. Sometime in one neighborhood, 30 churches. That's true. And everybody come out saved 30 different ways. That's right. And got 30 different gods. Amen. And it's funny because on practically all them 30 churches, the so-called Christ-like people mm -hmm. cursing. Amen. Even Bishop got a cigar. That's right. That's right. The deacons got them. Mm -hmm. Trustee got them. Amen. They come out with their round their arm around their girlfriend. That's right. And their girlfriend is the deacon's wife. That's true. Right. Or oh, your so-called Jerry Curl head reverend. Amen. He got his girlfriend. That's right. That's true. Yes. I'm going to hit you where you Amen. need to be hit. Amen. Until you preach a shape up, Amen. God going to ship you out to hell. Yes, he will. That's right. If you want to be a true soldier. True soldier. In God's camp. 
Amen. Camp holiness. That's right. That's right. This is camp holiness. Yes, it is. It's for the old, the middle aged, the young, the businesswoman. That's right. The homemaker. That's right. The lawyer. Amen. The governor. Oh, yeah. The politician. That's right. The mayor. Amen. God away, he said, my house shall be called the house of prayer for all people. All people. That's right. It is established for everybody. Everybody. But the catch is this. Mm -hmm. You have no say so or no addition Amen. or subtraction right. to what God already laid. Already laid. I right. can't put nothing. That's right. I have to give in to it. That's right. It doesn't matter if it kills me. I got to give in to it while I'm dying. My Lord. Amen. And because I want to be right, I refuse to run from the chastisement of God. That's right. I refuse to detour. Amen. Or a wall or run out. Amen. From the hardness of the, the scriptures. Of the scriptures. I'm determined to stay there. That's right. Stay right there. Go through the cuts. Amen. Receive the bruises. That's right. But I know I cannot be made nothing departing from God. That's right. Some of you listening to me are backsliders. Go ahead. And now you got your money. Amen. You got your job. That's right. You got your house. That's right. But you don't have God. Oh God. You's a fool. That's a fool. Amen. 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 What good is money without life? Without life. That's right. You have never experienced life. Amen. Until you experience God. That's right. That's true. But preacher. Amen. Preacher, you take the pulpit. And make it so fair seeming. That's right. You dress the pulpit up with your possessions. That's true. If you take note on television or radio, what is the common message? Prosperity. Amen. Nothing else. Nothing else. Because the devil knows folk want to be rich even if they go to hell. Go to, let them go to hell rich. That's right. They take riches over any day. Any day. But God away, push it aside. Amen. So the preacher will brag. Talk about the houses that he had. Oh, yeah. The cars that he had. That's right. How much money he make a year. Amen. The pulpit. Amen. It was plainly documented in the scriptures. What should be preached. Amen. The apostle Paul told Timothy. Amen. To preach. The word. Listen at this. In 2 Timothy chapter 4 and verse 2. What is it? Preach the word. Preach God. Preach him. That's right. Who cares about the amount of property you have? That's right. That's not for the pulpit. No, it's not. That's true. The amount of cars you drive, that's, that's not for the pulpit. the pulpit. That's right. The amount you make a year, so what? That's right. That's not for the, that's pulpit. For the pulpit. Amen. Preach the word. When you preach the word, that's it. The preacher must be a divine architect. That's right. Someone who's skilled in God how to master the blueprints that God outlined. That's right. Then he's also a student of a master builder. That's right. For God is the builder of the church. Amen. But the priest must be a divine stone cutter. That's right. For the word is tools. Tools. Amen. And the people are lively stones. That's right. And he must be able to know how to take the word to shape. Amen. And cut. Oh yeah. And chisel. That's right. A man and a woman for God. For God. That's right. Are you listening? Yes. Lord. He's a master builder. Master builder. God is a master builder and the student, That's which right. is the preacher or the messenger of God, work under the master builder. That's right. The first thing must be happen before you build, you got to do demolition. That's right. So we got to tear down your tear down. dirty mind. That's right. Huh? Amen. Tear down your filthy mind. Tear down. That's right. Clear the land off. Amen. With the bulldoze of the scriptures. That's right. Clear it, off. Clear it off. And then when you become clear headed, Amen. Then you got to level off the ground. That's right. You can clear ground off, but it ain't level. That's right. Huh? 
So once the ground is cleared off, you level. level. Then a person can think properly. That's right. They can think level headed. That's right. Then you begin to dig Amen. a foundation. Oh, yes. Because you're going to pour some good mortar of Order. cement and knowledge and understanding right. in the head. That's right. That's why you see the word kingdom Amen. in the scriptures. Amen. King and dome. Dumb. King is head of a kingdom. That's right. Dome is the top That's right. of a temple. Amen. Our body is the temple, temple of the living God. That's right. This is the dome. That's right. Man head is the dome of the body. Amen. But man head is a symbol of kingship. Because it is the head. That's right. But within the dome, it must be a king. That's right. Which is God. God. To rule man out of kingdom. Go ahead. And he must bring his whole body. Wonderful. Amen. Glory to God. Oh, yes. He must bring his whole body, his whole fleshy kingdom, Amen. unto submission. Amen. Wonderful. You're not allowed to rule yourself. No, no. Not allowed to do what you want to do. That's right. See, you folk, you go to church on Sunday and you felt good, and then you go back home and you take your dress off and put on hot pants. That's right. You in the church, and fellas, though, you done God a favor. Amen. You ain't did a thing for God. No, you didn't. Amen. You want to know what God want? Mm -hmm. He want obedience. That's right. Huh? That's right. Mr. Preacher, you ain't obeying God. No. You're not obeying him. You got too many wives. Too many wives. Amen. And too many boyfriends. That's right. You ain't obeying God. You're too drunk. Too drunk. Hmm? Amen. Well, man, you ain't obeying God. You're too materialistic. Amen. You're just trying to make all the money you can and forgot about who got you living. That's right. That's right. Folk, you got your priorities messed up. Amen. Listen at what the Bible says. Thou therefore endure hardness as oh, a good, good soldier. Endure Jesus hardness Christ. as a good soldier of Jesus Christ. And who would that soldier belong to? Of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. God own us. God own us. We ourselves don't belong to self. And we are not supposed to belong to Satan. That's right. We must belong to God. Belong to God. Amen. So once I get the full armor on, am I right? That's right. Get the breastplate of righteousness. That's right. Get the shield of faith. Well, I need some hair protection. Helmet of salvation. So I gotta put on the helmet of salvation. salvation. That's right. Because my mind think a bunch of foolishness. That's true. When I get the helmet of salvation, that means knowledge. You get the proper knowledge to protect and govern your mind. That's right. For it is written, let his mind be in you that was also in Christ Jesus. That's right. And what else? And the, and take the helmet of salvation. Yes. And the sword of the spirit. I need the sword of the spirit, which is the word. Which is the word of huh? God. That's right. You know, everyone don't know how to use a sword. No. You're liable to cut your own hand off. That's true. That's right. So a preacher must be a skilled Bible user. Amen. He must be a skilled scriptural user. That's right. Because the scripture is a two-edged sword. Yes, it is. Nothing about the scriptures is dull. No. Oh. It cuts you in any part of your life. That's right. Anywhere. Anywhere. It ain't a part of your life that you can think of or imagine where the Bible can't cut you. That's true. For the scriptures right. is the thoughts of God. Amen. What do you have in mind concerning man? Concerning man. Bible said, who know the mind of the Lord? Oh, yes. What else did he say? In Ephesians 6 and verse 17. Yeah. And take the helmet of salvation and the sword of the spirit, which is the word of God. Yes. Praying always. Praying always. With all prayer and supplication. And supplication in, the spirit, in what? In the spirit. In the spirit. And watching thereunto. Observe thereunto. With all perseverance and supplication for all saints. You got to be ready. Got to be ready. When you're a soldier, you must be ready for every good work. That's right. When you're in a reserve and America go to war, your reserve is over when you're called. Right. Amen. Now in this, we ain't never on reserve. Oh, no. Never. You're on duty all the time. All the time. Active duty all the time. That's right. 
That's right. You can never go back to the civilian life. No, no. A life of sin. Amen. You got to stay in God on it. Stay in there. That's you got to be a good soldier, a loyal soldier, a committed soldier. Amen. Commitment comes from a person when they love a thing. That's right. The commander in chief have never deserted any of us. No, he have Many of us deserted him. Amen. That's true. He ain't did nothing wrong to none of us. That's right. We have mistreated him. Amen. God is faithful towards us. That's right. Are you listening? Amen. Amen. Glory to God. Amen. What did he say there? Thou therefore endure hardness as a good soldier of Jesus Christ. So we're always on active duty. Amen. Active. Our life stay active. Stay active. Serving God. Mm -hmm. Worshiping God. That's right. God made you, television viewer and radio listener, and you that are here for his glory. His glory. Amen. Not for us to glory in ourselves. No, no. So when these lying false prophets that you love to see every morning just talk about prosperity and brag about their house and brag about their cars and all that garbage, the garbage. pulpit ain't never been designed for that. No, no, never. He ain't nothing but a businessman. That's all. And I saw his church has become business. That's right. Huh? That's right. Big fundraiser. Amen. You raise all the money you can, then you go to hell after his raise. That's right. Are you listening? That's true. If I'm going to be in God's army, mm -hmm. I must arm myself likewise and have one mind. That's right. I can't be an unstable soldier. No, no. Because if I'm unstable, I could be influenced to commit treason. That's right. Huh? That's right. You see, if I'm unstable, I can be influenced to commit treason, which simply mean backsliding. That's right. But if I'm stable, the world may pull. Mm -hmm. The former sinner friends may pull. Amen. But because I'm anchored, anchored. Mm -hmm. and there's no discharge out of this war, no, no. I have to stay and go through the hardship. That's right. Notice Ecclesiastes 8 and 8. In Ecclesiastes chapter 8 and at verse 8. Move quick. There is no man that hath power over the spirit. There is no man that hath power over the spirit. To retain the spirit. To retain the spirit. Neither hath he power in Neither the day of death. Neither hath he power in the day of death. And there is no discharge. There is no discharge. In that war. Amen. Amen. Can get out. Can get out of it. That's if you want to be right. That's right. Television viewer, if you want to be right, the false church you in couldn't hold you another Sunday. No, no. Look at how long you've been there, how much money you gave there over the years. Amen. Money is no criteria for heaven. No, it's not. You'll go to hell being a millionaire. That's right. You can't buy God out. No, no. No, no. These preachers have sold out. Amen. You need a preacher that won't sell you out. That's right. Won't sell you out for money. That's right. You preachers have sold out for money. You have sold out for popularity. Amen. You have sold out for some hips. You have sold out for some thighs. That's right. That's right. And you done sold out so long until now you justify dirt. That's right. And the way you got religion, it's no sin to be a sinner. Amen. You sold out years sold ago. Out. Old false prophets sold out. That's right. That's Bent right. over, still sold out. Still sold out. Long as your young secretary keep you warm. My lord. Go ahead. Sold out. Sold out. What do you say there? And there is no discharge in that war. You sold out because you make twenty five thousand a month. That's right. You sold out. Sold out. For now, you preach what only pleases the people. Amen. All right. Repent of your sins, viewer. This is the only new birth, only way to be saved. Repent of your sins. Be baptized in water in the name of Jesus Christ. Receive the Holy Ghost. Leave the false church you're in. I don't care who's your pastor, how much you love him. 
is heaven to hell. Tune in again next week. I'll be back to suck it to you.